My name is Jennifer. My name is Wendell. My name is Julia. My name is Ellen. My name is Angeline. My name is Elijah. I identify as a woman. My gender identity is male. Um, I identify as female by birth, but as in terms of like gender identity, I think it's pretty fluid. I wouldn't say woman or man. I would say there's more of a, um, a grayness to it. Um, I identify as trigender, but there has been some wondering towards um, whether I might be female to male transgender. I identify as female. Um, at the moment, I'm choosing just not to identify as anything in particular. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. I have never questioned my gender. I have questioned my gender um, many times. I think the thing that stands out for me the most about my gender is that um, the implication of being a woman is that you will date men, and I don't. I've never really questioned my gender in terms of whether I'm a man or a woman, but I have questioned it in terms of how I play out my gender or perform my gender, uh, so if it's more masculine or more feminine. I wouldn't say that I have questioned my gender because I do not want to be female. I have questioned my gender because of expectations that I feel like are being put on me as a female. There, I don't think there was a particular moment. I had been thinking about it for a while. And, I mean, as a kid, I was just a kid. I didn't really care. Um, and I didn't feel like I fit into all the stereotypes about being a girl, but I didn't really give it more thought than that because it was just such a given that I was a girl because I was born a girl. There was this manga, this Japanese comic book series called Ranma One Half, and the basic idea behind, or behind a lot of it, was that Ranma, um, born male, male identified, whenever he is splashed with cold water, he turns into a girl. Whenever he gets splashed with warm water, he turns into a guy. And so <laughs> I just remember in middle school that I used to wish that I could do that. I just sort of ask that people start using a different name and different pronouns. You know, it, it definitely wasn't simple. It wasn't easy at all. Like, I didn't know what I wanted. Um, a lot of people said to me when I said, call me he, said to me, um, you know, that's, that's just strange. I never really got a male vibe from you. And to me, I was just like, well, that's, that's fine, I guess, but, but what does that even mean? I, I don't really understand. When I talked to my brother about it, I told him that I didn't identify specifically as one gender. He said that he, he thought that everyone was like that to some degree. Do ask about it at least for me personally, ask about it, talk about it. I think that's the only way we can move forward in any way. I think it's really awesome and healthy that these kind of questions are being asked. People can humanize people instead of making them this object, that gay person or, or that trans, transgender person, that's somebody's son. That's somebody's boyfriend, loved one. It's not just some random person. Well, be who you feel like you are. I won't, I certainly won't mind. Girl, boy, smurf, elf, ninja, I don't care. 